Today is Independence Day. Not 4th of July, but Independence Day. A little excerpt from a speech here from 1980s by Ronald Reagan. I'd like to share with the, our fellow patriots out there. Because, you know, the people who want to take our firearms away are the people that want to take our life, liberty, and pursuit of happiness away. You know, the globalists, the New World Order, etc., etc., the political elites. No more allegiance to a country, just allegiance to the almighty dollar. So, 56 men came forward to sign the parchment. It was noted at the time that they pledged their lives, their fortunes, and their sacred honors. And that was more than rhetoric. Each of those men knew the penalty for high treason to the crown, Phil Murphy. We must all hang together, Benjamin Franklin said, or assuredly, we will all hang separately. And John Hancock, it is said, wrote his signature in large script so King George could see it without his spectacles. They were brave. They stay brave through all the bloodshed of the coming years. Their courage created a nation built on a universal claim to human dignity on the proposition that every man, woman, and child had a right to the future of freedom. For just a moment, let us listen to the words again. We hold these truths to be self-evident, that all men are created equal, that they are endowed by their creator with certain unalienable rights, that among these are life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness. This is what we should be teaching our children. This is what we should be hanging on to. Those that had the most to lose risked it all for our freedom. Just like us fellow patriots that have been fighting so long for this Thomas ruling that is so long overdue. And now what happens? The seven states that have been violating our rights for years on end, now where are they? They're creating more rules and regulations to further take our rights away. They will not listen to the Supreme Court, the highest court of the land. A big F you to all of them. This is our Independence Day. We the people, men, women, and children, of this country, us citizens, it has to be said, it has to be worth something to still be a citizen of this country. They are taking it away and watering it down. Hollywood, both the coastal elites, our elected officials. Let's review again. We have judges that don't judge criminals anymore. We have prosecutors that don't prosecute criminals anymore. And we have elected officials that we send to the state houses across the country and to Washington, D.C., and could give a shit about what they think, what we think. All they care about is lining their pockets. So on this Independence Day, let's reflect what all of our family and our friends, that still, this is the greatest experiment in the world, but we are losing it rapidly. And we must all join together. Screw tribalism. We must all join together because we are all Americans first. God bless America.